Hello everyone, today we have new video review and as you can see this time we are going to talk about fresh book from Volant Wings and this is already 16th book from Airframe and Miniature series so it comes as a, I have one of the biggest publishings from or publications from this publisher and as you can see it's really thick, it comes as a soft cover and it is dedicated to such a famous aircraft such as Hawker uh, Hurricane and you can see that it's written by Richard Franks. So here we have a commercial sample and it will be interesting to see what is actually supplied here because some others were really waiting for this release and now it should be available. So basically you can order it straight away if you don't want to wait. And believe me, this is really a handy book if you plan to build this aircraft and today we are going to talk why this is a worthy purchase for your collection. So first of all, I say that this is a soft cover and publisher pro promises more than 200 pages as far as I remember and price will be around 25 British pounds which is more or less reasonable in my opinion so now we are going to open it and check what is actually printed here so let me close the camera a bit so that it won't be that dark okay so here is the contents page we can zoom in a bit and you can see that overall book structure is more or less standard for this series so we start with airframe chapters and here we check the evolution of this aircraft then we go on with a sea hurricane and canadian production which is quite surprising frankly speaking i was expecting to see them in a separate book next we have recon versions and also separate chapter about camouflage and markings and and also color profiles for this aircraft. Next is a miniature chapter section and here we have a whole chapter dedicated to hurricane kits and then there is a building a selection, building a collection in detail and obviously this in detail section is dedicated to real photos of the real aircraft they might be handy as a reference material let's say for your detailed builds and doesn't matter which scale you choose still you find something interesting and of course everything finishes with appendices so here we have kit list accessory list and this thing is handy in, in case you would like to build or let's say set a whole list of the possible accessories you would like to use in your build then definitely check this chapter so here we go on with the glossary and then we start with the preface so here we have chapters dedicated to the development history of this aircraft of course it is supplied with black and white photos and some of them will be really handy in uh, weathering ideas maybe in some diorama ideas in case you're building a lot of dioramas with aircraft definitely this is a valuable photos so do not overlook them and there should be more than 200 photos in this book this is really impressive number in my opinion so you can see that there are various i would say situations depicted on these pictures obviously they are mostly black and white but i suppose that walk around section will be uh, color printed but we will see here we have evolution chapter so it comes from mk2 to mk5 and here we have quite a handy layout because you can see that we have not only the side profiles we have also photos so basically you can see visually what are the main differences between this or that type of the hurricane so it's also useful thing for these modellers who are not familiar with hurricane they would like to learn more what is the difference let's say between mk3 and mk4 here it is explained in a quite concise form and it's easy to understand so you won't be lost trying to find a tiny difference between this or that aircraft here we go on with recon version so as you remember there is a separate chapter and these aircraft are interesting on its own so maybe you will decide to replicate this type of aircraft so who knows maybe it will be handy for you and next we go on with the camouflage and markings chapter and here we have exactly what i was talking about so we have color print and we have color printed profiles this is not a full camouflage marking scheme so let's say so if you would like to see top view or maybe bottom view you will have to find more i would say material about this aircraft but this might be handy feature for this modelers who are undecided on which marking to choose for their build because here we have a lot of interesting markings from different aircraft squadrons as you can see even this red aircraft is included here and black as well 
and all this stuff is supplied with necessary photos so it's not only the um, profiles color profiles we also have black and white photos depicting the same aircraft which is shown on the profile which is really handy because it will give you some understanding on how it looked like in real life and we all know that there are some let's say um, small issues on some markings because there are not precise colors or something else we all know this thing so on black and white uh, photos author actually gives you possibility to decide on your own here we have also the drawings and this is more of a stencil placement so that you understand where this or that symbol was placed exactly so that you have a more or less realistic placement of the stencils on your model next we continue with more markings here quite interesting blue aircraft here we have i guess some foreign aircraft even finnish <laughs> interesting romanian hmm i didn't even know that there was a hurricane in romania so if you know something about this write in the comment section here we continue with a separate section which is dedicated to the hurricane and sea hurricane kits so it covers all possible scales and in case you are searching for example in a 170 second scale you can find a whole list of the possible kits you can choose for your build of course there will be Arma Hobby which we reviewed on our YouTube channel as well and here we start with the build so I do not see which scale it is I guess yeah 170 second scale air fix so you can see that we have a lot of I would say small tips on what you can do with your model as you can see for the it comes with a small writing underneath and it can be treated as an explanation of what you can do with your model it's really handy in case you are building the same kit and next we have sea hurricane it's fly kit in 130 second scale so definitely bigger kit but still an interesting project for this who like big scale models here we continue with a quite interesting chapter which shows you in a more or less understandable and easily digestible way a main difference between various types so all these dark gray areas are the difference between later and earlier types so you know which cover should be on your particular version so really handy feature and here we have in detail chapter so this one covers real aircraft with black and white actually with color photos and black and white photos as well so it will be handy for super detailing your aircraft and as i said it doesn't matter which scale you choose still you'll find something interesting for your build and it will be worth copying on your aircraft and here in the end we have appendix which is dedicated to the full list of possible kits accessories and decal sets for this aircraft so how many pages 272 and on the last page we have also this drawings insert so i guess these drawings are supplied in 148 scale still it will be handy in order to understand the uh, right panel lines and rivets on your aircraft so really useful addition and here on the last page we have signs of the units which use this aircraft so all in all we have really hefty publication about this hawker hurricane aircraft and in case you plan to build this model as i said before definitely invest in this book because it will be a valuable addition in your library and of course i will be happy to hear your opinion about such release write it here in the comment section below if you like this video don't forget to press the like button subscribe to our youtube channel and i will see you in the next video review as usual thank you for joining me today and bye